So net neutrality is now gone. As pr predicted, as expected, a deep pie and his two cronies decided to get rid of the only safety net that we have here on the internet from our cable companies and our internet providers restricting what we can and cannot see, what we can and cannot do, what we can and cannot say, and what services we use over theirs. I'm not sure what it means for me yet since I'm using Time Warner, Spectrum, whatever, but the, um, the future will tell. However, a lot of people will be, will be going, well, what does that mean for YouTube? What does that mean for the YouTubers? Does that mean that they're not going to be doing content anymore? Well, I don't know about everyone else. I do not know about everyone else, but I'm not going any damn where at all. And I hope that, you know, YouTube at least doesn't end up getting restricted anyway, because, I mean, YouTube and um, Twitch are two big companies owned by two even bigger companies, so I'd assume that they would want to continue to have everyone in the world watch their content on their websites, so they'll probably be fine. However, my own personal website, other people's websites, places like Facebook, Twitter, and stuff like that may go down, at least for a time. We may end up seeing certain certain smaller websites disappear. Certain web apps that we've been accustomed to using going away. But you know what you know what really, really sucks? The fact that even though this probably is gonna be a temporary thing, and I'll get to that in a moment in a moment. Even though this is gonna end up probably being temporary, it's still gonna leave a big impact. And there are still going to be a lot of people that are demonized for this, including people like our own <laughs> uh, dear old Donnie Trump, um, Ajit Pai, of course, him and his two cronies are on my bucket. I mean, on my uh, blacklist of people that I'm never going to walk up to in public and say, hi, how you doing today? No, I'll be like, hi, asshole, and walk away. <laughs> but, you know, I just... Uh, so, what do I mean by it's probably going to be temporary? Well, there are people that are already at work on finding ways to get regulation back, including lawsuits, state regulation, which they're going to find loopholes, I believe. They're, they are going to find loopholes, which make it more difficult for the companies to... Um, to screw over their customers but really I think the main point is that I th I hope I hope I hope I hope that this makes it to you all right but I hope we end up getting these corporate shells and you know, believe me a jeep pie is nothing more than a corporate shell He's the kind of guy that, as long as someone's putting money in his wallet, he doesn't care what he has to do in order to continue earning that money. Verizon paid him off. Time Warner probably paid him off. The other companies probably paid him off. Everyone's trying to, to serve their own interests instead of the interests of the people. That's, what's the, that's what the problem is today. <clears throat> but I digress. So... Am I going anywhere? No. The Wandering Wind, unless I unless I get completely shut down, like I can't even access YouTube, I'll wait the three to five hours it'll take to upload a single video, if that's what it ends up being. I'll wait the 30 minutes to open up my Facebook page, just to write a 30-word a post and wait another five minutes for it to finish posting. I will wait the 45 minutes it takes for sites like Twitter to open up because of all the media heavy stuff before I can actually post a tweet that hopefully will help. I'll wait all that because you know what? I don't care. I just want to continue to connect with you. 
And if I end up not being able to do Twitch, I'll be sad, but I'm not going to be, you know, sad for long because I know this won't probably last. This probably won't last very long. <clears throat> People will get tired of it. People will start to fight against it. People will learn what the true impact of this is and they'll they'll change it. They will. I know they will. I have faith that the American people, if nobody else knows how to get shit done, knows how to change things for the better. Personally though, I hope against hope that this is the last we hear about any government company selling out the corporate be the corporate businesses. The last time. Because I tell you what, I hate this. I tell you what, I hate this. I hate seeing this happen in this day and age. This day and age, this day, we have such... Uh, it's so damn depressing, I think. Having this happen day in and day out. <clears throat> anyway, thank you guys so much for watching, for taking the time out of your day to load up a soon-to-be half-hour-long wait for a video to come up, and then a five-minute per second load time for buffering on YouTube. Personally, if you can manage to afford to get faster speeds, good on you. But I don't think I'll be able to do that much. I don't think I'll be able to do that much at all. Anyway, if this is my last video, I do hope that you guys have a great day. But, you know, probably not. I'll, I'll still continue to make content as long as I'm able to op open up YouTube. So, you know, what happens, happens. YouTube isn't going anywhere. I'm not going anywhere. We'll get through this together, I promise. Have a great day.